my channel and welcome to another vlog so the twins are currently napping at the minute they've been asleep for around an hour and this nap is usually between two to three hours so i kind of like give myself time to like pump get ready for the day clean little bits and bobs catch up on work things it's quite like a nice amount of time to like do stuff in the day which is really really lovely but how are you guys i hope you're doing really well i thought i could just get ready with you guys today um, I'm doing my makeup. I've curled my hair and I'm now just getting ready. I really feel like I'm slowly just getting back to like me, if that makes sense. I just love doing my hair and makeup. It just makes me feel so much better and like more productive and just ready for the day and I just love it. I've got some new makeup today that I'm so excited to try and I thought we could do it together. So I'm really excited to say that this portion of today's video is really kindly sponsored by Look Fantastic. You guys know I love and adore Look Fantastic and the fact that I get to work with them is a dream come true. So I've picked some new makeup that I haven't tried before um, and I thought we could test it together. At the minute Look Fantastic have up to 40% off plus you can use my discount code amyrosewlf and you'll get an extra 10% off that as well which is just amazing so i picked out a couple of products and i've also got some new products that i've never tried before like i said i love getting all of my like beauty and skincare products from look fantastic and um, so i popped on these eye masks which look fantastic do stock elements and then also my daily moisturizer which i absolutely love i had a good amount of sleep last night but i'm just i feel really like puffy it feels more hay fever to be honest with you than actual like tiredness do you know sometimes with allergies you feel itchy and it makes your eyes feel like puffy and tired that's kind of what i feel like you can also shop all of these products via the look fantastic app um, which just makes it really easy and convenient to use as well and i love having it up as well because all my products are there it just makes it really easy just to shop and i just love how look fantastic stock so many incredible brands I'm using the underglow blowing primer by iconic london just to kind of have a base for my makeup so i'm going to quickly do my brows and then i'm going to come back because they just take forever brows are now done they don't look that good but anyway um, for foundation, I've got the Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation from NARS in the shade Medium for Barcelona. I hope this isn't going to be too dark. I have got a L'Oreal foundation as well. I think this will match my skin when I've turned. And I literally turned the other day, but it's just faded. So I'm going to mix this with the L'Oreal Infallible 23 Hour Fresh Wear, which I also got on at Fantastic as well. Just going to push the product in with my beauty blender now um but i think i used to use this foundation ages ago but i absolutely love how it looks on my skin i think it's really nice and also mixed with the l'oreal one it is really really lovely so yeah so far so good and it feels really buildable as well okay so the foundation is on it feels really really lovely so for concealer, I feel really bougie, but this is also why I love Look Fantastic because you can literally get drugstore products and also really bougie products as well at the same time. So this is YSL All Hours Precise Angles Concealer. Guys, look at the packaging. I'm not being funny. How beautiful is this? I can't deal with it. Um, so I kind of had to guess my shade, but looking at it in person, I feel like this is perfect. This is in the shade LW1 um, and it looks amazing. So let's do one side first and like we can compare. Okay, I really like the applicator. Okay, the colour to me is literally perfect. I'm going to go in with my Beauty Blender as well. I love that. I really love that because it's really sort of subtle. And it's not too thick, but it covers. Like, I can really notice a difference. I'm so happy with that. Okay, I love this, and I love the packaging. For cream contour, I'm going to use my favourite NARS Laguna 3. It's like cream bronzer. Um, I've had this for ages, and it's honestly the most beautiful cream bronzer ever. And I use the lid to kind of, like, blend in the product. And then and then I'll go in and then it's kind of more like subtle because if you go in too much of the product you don't want it to look patchy or cakey so I just kind of like build it up but it's such a nice glow to your skin again I'll do half just so you guys can like 
see the difference because I think it's insane. So you can see the difference. It's like subtle but it's nice. I always get questions on my eyeshadow. I don't have any on at the minute. I think I've got naturally like dark eyelids and I've even got a bit of concealer in those as well. But what I do like to use, it's not even an eyeshadow palette, it's a brow palette from Benefit. It's the Browsings and I use, as you can see, the top shade here <laughs> because it's more of like an ashy colour and I feel like it just looks better than using one of my bronzers, although bronzer is good. I just prefer more of an ashy look and a little goes a long way as you can see. So I literally just do it on my eyes like that and then I get more of like a dense brush and then I'll just do it on my lash line as well. And this just helps make me look a little bit more awake than what I feel, which is great. So I'm going to use the L'Oreal Panorama one. I actually showed you guys this in my last video I done with Look Fantastic and this is incredible. So I've added my mascara to both of my eyes. For like my highlight and blush, I've seen this one from Iconic London. I've always liked to get like my blushes and highlights from there. Oh my God, guys, how insane is this? I'm so excited to use this. I've done it to this side of my face. It's so glowy and makes me just look more like alive and healthier. <gasps> I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm just gonna take my hair out. This is the final look of my makeup. I'm so happy with it. I feel like it's just, I feel like it's just been so nice to sit, get ready together, like use really nice product. I'm just obsessed. But one thing I always like to finish off with perfume because obviously with the twins, they're premature, that they were newborn. I never wanted to wear perfume around them because I wanted them to get used to like me, the scent of me. Um, and also I know it can be quite harsh and stuff on them. But now they're a lot older, I've started in, I've started using perfume now, but now they're a bit older, I've started using perfume and I have missed it so much. It literally just finishes off getting ready, don't you think? It's like the cherry on top. I feel like I'm not fully ready until I've sprayed perfume. Anyway, I've got a new one from Burberry. This is the goddess one. Guys, the scent of this is beautiful. I'm gonna pop the description on screen because I'm not very good at describing scents, but this has definitely got vanilla in. It just smells amazing it kind of smells like creamy almost i really i'm rubbish at describing scents this is such a good spring summer scent oh my god i'm obsessed with it and also the bottle alone is absolutely stunning i cannot wait to put this on my dressing table <laughs> i love this so don't forget look fantastic currently have up to 40 percent off plus you can use my code amy rose wlf and you'll get an extra 10 percent off that as well which is just amazing. And you can shop all your favorite beauty brands. You can shop skincare brands. You can shop skincare brands as well, like Elemis. I always buy Elemis bits and bobs from there. And like I said, it's just the perfect place to get anything. And I love how you can literally get drugstore stuff and also higher end things as well. So it's the best of both. So yeah, I'll put all the links to the products that I use in the description box down below in case you guys want to check them out. And thank you so much to Lip Fantastic for partly sponsoring today's video. I thought I'd show you in better lighting the makeup up close like how beautiful is it like the blusher the foundation everything i'm so obsessed with so i've just got the twins out of their cot and i put them on the bed and i'm gonna make the bed with them on it because that's what life is now let's make the bed beddy beddy bed i mean it's never as neat as it used to be what's the time are you too hungry are you too hungry? You are somebody. You are hungry. Look at your little princess. Give me love. Give me all your love. Oh, cause I want you. No one else makes me feel this way. Don't know what you do. Hold my hand. Could you hold my hand? Look me. The twins are literally over there asleep. You're probably going to hear Ewan, the sheep, shushing. I don't have anything for lunch. <laughs> so I'm going to make, I mean, obviously I've found something, but I don't know if it's going to be nice. I'm going to make chia batter 
that like margarita pizzas and like cut them in half we literally don't have anything else and i was gonna walk to the shop with the twins it's currently raining <laughs> like torrential rain so yeah that's great so i'm gonna make these pizzas hopefully they taste nice i don't know um and i've got my ipad i basically fed them five ounces and they demolished it so i put more on then they got sleepy then i like, sort of picked them up a bit and like dream fed them and i'm hoping they'll go longer but who knows this is the nap that they tend to do for like 20 minutes <laughs> and i really want it to be like an hour so let's see sunny day in late july and everything turned upside down I almost lost track of time as weeks went by I couldn't get him off my mind I told him I want that great love Like standing in the middle of a bonfire You don't know how you got there but you hold tight Knowing that you can't get burned Just tell me how we lost track of everything but each other I honestly don't know And tell me how we messed up Drifting away from each other Didn't want to let you go okay so when i put the twins down in the pram i was so hopeful that they'd sleep for a long time did they no it was literally 20 minutes and they wake up at the exact same time and they move at the same time it's so strange anyway i was playing with them and then they're getting overtired so i've now put them down for their long nap of the day in their cot together so yeah they'll be asleep for a good few hours now i just if any of you guys have any tips on how your baby sleep in their pram for a long period of time please let me know <laughs> because i try everything i've tried to like dream feed them um we use you and the sheep it's like a white noise teddy thing um, they really like that that always sends them to sleep but in their cots and like when we put them to bed and stuff at night but it's just the pram like do you reckon it's because they're used to sleeping together i don't know what it is <laughs> and i just it's driving me mad because i want to like go out and like plan things like, i want to for example go to the shops and then plan it during their long nap time so i've got like two or three solid hours where i know that they'll nap or if we're at a family event or something and I just know that they'll nap in their pram, it just, it makes our lives so much easier, but they just don't like to do it. <laughs> so then we're like, okay, so they just lighten up and in their cot and it's just, it's really cute and it's perfect when we're at home. But I do want that nap in the day, one of them, to be in their pram. So if you guys have any tips, please let me know. <laughs> because I don't know what to do now. Anyway, I'm still in my dressing gown. <laughs> I'm still in my dressing gown and my pyjama bottoms. It's been one of those days where I've got ready, like my face and my hair, but my clothes, they just haven't made it on. And I think because what I was gonna do is take them out for a walk in their pram. And the thing is, if I go for a walk, they'll sleep. As soon as I stop, they wake up. It's like they know. When they had their pram nap, I was gonna go for a walk. Then it started raining and I thought, no, we're not. So I've just stayed in my pajamas. Anyway, I went into Primark the other day. This is my first Primark haul this year, I think, actually. I haven't been in there um, and it was so nice to go in there. So I don't have enough for like a dedicated haul, but I thought I would just show you guys in a vlog because you guys like vlogs. Also, if the lighting changes, I'm really sorry. Um, okay, first up, oh my God, I'm so excited to wear these. Um, I got these pajama bottoms guys how insane are they they are the softest things i've ever felt 12 pounds 12 pounds can you believe that they're ribbed they are ridiculously soft i'm literally obsessed with them and then i got a matching cami top which was seven pounds um and i thought this is such a nice set it could either be a loungewear set or pajamas i think it was in the loungewear bit but i mean you could even wear it as both like you could dress it up or dress it down but i kind of <laughs> wear pajamas and loungewear like the same but how nice is that can you guys believe the quality like the ribbed how insane 
also can we just ignore my nails so when i last got them done at my sister's salon um normally with her you need to book up in advance which you do and i just assumed we had more appointments after because we've always done it we've always just like booked months and months ahead and we didn't <laughs> and i'm not even joking my nails were like grown up i mean you would have seen in my previous videos they were just embarrassing embarrassing so i don't have an appointment i think until a week and a half so i've had to take it upon myself and i did my own gels and it's just it's painful i mean they look fine from afar but look at up front they just do not look good do they i mean they're not bad it did take me two hours two hours and i don't have two hours to do my nails anymore i just don't so i just yeah i'm gonna scrap the idea of doing them myself because they just they're not the best so let's ignore those oh my god i forgot i got these oh these are so cute um these are for the twins little sleep suits seven pound fifty so it's got little elephants on this one i prefer i think it's so cute but this is the kind of stuff that i like to put the twins in like same but different i wouldn't buy two packets of these so then they wore exactly the same i kind of like mix and match do you know what i mean that's how i like to dress them like i'll dress them in the same things but different colors that's just kind of what i like um i picked up a few of these now people wear these as tops <laughs> I size down in them and wear them with bras um so yeah these are just comfortable bras and they're big enough to fit my pump in and I wore these before I was pregnant before I had the twins um so yeah they're so comfortable and they're only £3.50 and I got how gorgeous is this one this beautiful like spring summer one as well which I think is adorable I picked up some short sleeve bodysuits these are basically vests um, which look really cute. I haven't actually tried any Primark baby clothes before. I just haven't. And I think in the Primark in Brighton, every time I've gone to get the twin stuff, it's just been awful. Like, I'm not going to lie. It's just not been good. The girl stuff looks quite cute. But the boy stuff, mm -mm, it's not my style. Um, but I saw these in a Primark that we went to when we went to Kent. Um, and they look really good. So I'm really happy to. I mean, best don't need to be that nice i just thought they're cute okay i picked up which i'm so impressed with padded maternity bras padded like i'm so happy with this i'm so excited to wear these um these were 10 pounds for two how good is that but they're padded it's gonna make so much difference i'm just sick and tired of not wearing clothes because your nipples are just there and don't get me wrong free the nip <laughs> but when you're expressing and you're breastfeeding i don't know i feel like if you know you know what's all i'm gonna say on that um so the fact that they did padded ones i'm very happy about as you can tell so i'm so excited to wear these <laughs> ah, the joys of breastfeeding and expressing um, and then i picked up uh, just a couple of accessories hairbands because i honestly don't even know where they go um this is my handbag because i'm sick and tired of taking my massive hairbrush with me um this is only a pound which is so good just to fit in your hairband your hairband your handbag um, and then lastly these sunglasses every spring summer i will get a pair of sunglasses from primark because they're just so good so i saw them in black picked the black ones up and then i thought actually I think I prefer these ones, like tortoise shell. Let's try. I haven't even tried them on. Let's try, shall we? What do you guys think? I mean, <laughs> ignore the label, but I really like them. And you can kind of like put them up like that with your hair. Yay, happy with them. Really like these. Three pound fifty is so good. Um, I've actually. Oh, last thing. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, the last thing I got is probably my favourite. These were £3.50 as well. Okay, these are earrings. Guys, they are like weighty earrings. They're not plasticky. They're like weighty. I picked them up and I was like, oh my god. They're like heavy, which is good. You know that's good quality. Um, and I like them. They're all like slightly different. And I think they look really nice. So, very happy about my gold earrings. <laughs> 
as you guys can tell. But I was just really impressed. You know when Primark don't usually have weighty ones? Like Primark jewellery I get just to wear like for dinner or I don't know, an occasion because otherwise my ears are going to go blue. But those are good. Going back to the sunglasses, um, I have a pair that are the dupes for the Tom Ford ones that they're like basically like really big. They're kind of like butterfly. And I think I wear the Primark ones more because they're just so easy. And I always thought you had to spend so much money on like sunglasses and accessories. But Primark had some lovely stuff in there. We were rushing and I really wish I filmed like new in because it was really good. Um, but yeah, definitely go in because they've got really cute like bags and stuff like that at the minute. I just thought, I'm just not going to get another one. <laughs> I just can't. Maybe if I did a haul because then I could just take it all back. But I just thought I'd show you guys what I picked up in Primark because I just thought it's quite cute at the minute. Good morning everyone. So we are now in Kent. I'm just getting ready for the day. Um, I actually filmed a vlog a few, maybe last week or week before when we were in Kent but we're back just to see my family over Easter and stuff um, the twins and Bradley are currently napping and I'm getting ready I've cut my hair this morning and I'm just in the bathroom doing my makeup and we're gonna have some breakfast soon my cousins are on their way around um, I think I'm gonna go on a walk today at some point which I think will be really nice just to get out um, take the twins out so yeah looking forward to today just do my makeup as usual. Is in <laughs> Hello. Molly. And today, it is quite a nice day today. Well, actually. Beautiful. It's a little bit overcast. I've just gone t-shirt. Yeah, I've just gone Brushed jumper. It. It's just, I don't know. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully it doesn't get colder. No, um, but we're gonna go for a walk. It's called St. Mary's Island. Yeah. Yeah, that's where we're going. Do you love I St know. Mary's Island? So we're gonna. Oh, I yeah, know. Yeah, you do. Um, what else do you love? Nothing. No. So we're gonna go there with everyone, which I think will be really lovely. And then I don't know what our plan is for later. Do you? No. We're just gonna see where the wind takes us. Yes. Full-time prankster. You're not a full-time prankster. Don't take what I say um, we're taking the Cybex pram today. Bradley thinks he's really funny. Um, we're just changing it up, aren't we? We like to mix it up. Sorry. 